all right all right welcome to this week's edition of weekly news roundup i'm jenna mccarthy and i'm molly breen what are we gonna get started with today jenna well first on the list the times higher education has published a list of the best colleges and we are number five Woo! Woo! Who be in, us? in first place is Caltech. I know that one is kind of random. Harvard and Stanford are in a tie, and then Oxford, and then us. So mm. seems like kind of a kind of a strange list, a bit of a departure from you know U.S. News and World Report. What are like the metrics they used? Um, I don't know, but I think something to do with like international co-authorship is factored into there so it, it seems like it's a little bit of a different system than what we're used to with some of the other rankings but anyway we're in fifth place so mm. sounds pretty good to me all right <clears throat> is there a goldfish in my teeth nope you're good all right <laughs> so moving right along apparently people on campus are not happy with slow internet to which I say, get an Ethernet cable and stop watching porn. <laughs> Moving right along, what's next? Also, one more thing about the internet. One more thing about the internet. To nobody's surprise, internet usage peaks at night. Anyway. Telling you. Telling you. Be creative with your masturbatory practices. <laughs> um, so, there has been, there is a committee formed to investigate Greek life, and they have just released the members. So, there are six students, three of which are involved in Greek organizations, two professors, and three deans. Hmm. So, they'll be cool figuring stuff. out how to implement the freshman brush ban, I guess. Yes. Interesting to, have to see how this will unfold. Mm -hmm. Perhaps we'll see more editorials about... Greek life as Woo. a result of this. I don't know. Tell the um, truth when you <clears throat> lie to me, Shirley. What was it? What was it? Be honest when you lie Be to me, Shirley, 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 I think. All right. To go with the theme of Shirley. Anyway. Shirley. Um, Maddie is launching a pilot program to have mentoring for girls, specifically. Cool stuff. Very cool stuff. Maddie. So, yeah, if this works out, I guess um, yeah. this will be expanded to some of the other res colleges, which is yeah. awesome. I mean, other organizations on campus already have, like, mentoring programs, like Luna yeah. and other <laughs> things, but I don't know. I, I think, think there, there's, like, it. a general mentoring program, too, like, I yeah. don't know. I don't know who runs it, but... Well, it's a pilot program, so it's supposed to be kind of shaky. Yeah. That's the idea. All right. Oh, wait. We, we forgot. Yeah. Street news. Lots of street news mm -hmm. this week. TI is finally done with its renovations. I think they added 5,000 more square feet. Crikey. Yeah. And it was like the first, I think it was the only club still in operation that had not had a major renovation in the past 20 years or whatever. I don't think it's been renovated ever, actually. I don't know. I don't but, know. yeah, it seems like it's pretty big renovation. But, yeah. Yay for TI. They expanded their... Um, yeah. Dining room, I think, by like 60-something seats. Yeah, uh, Canon sent an email to upperclassmen this week offering them social membership in the club at a very discounted price if they were to sign... 75% off. Yeah, if they were to sign a contract to be full members of it next year. Yeah, so I think it was very about... interesting. ...something like 600 or $700 to be a member, which is a bargain compared to a lot of the other clubs, <laughs> but I guess it depends on whether or not you want to give up your current dining situation to be a part of canon so i guess we'll see how that works out yeah then fall bicker wrapped up this last weekend i guess mm -hmm. and <clears throat> people bickered some were chosen some, some weren't were such is life yeah i think such is life there was a smaller and choosier fall bicker that i was, actually that was i don't the... think numerically that worked i think what happened i don't know i don't know i but there were the, the less prince, people chosen at CAP than there were last year because more people bickered. So I don't conversely, know. Conversely, I think more people were chosen at Tower. Yes. And Ivy chose. I don't know. Like, I think Ivy took eight out of like 20 people, which seems okay. to be like in line with their other fall bickers in past years. But cool. yeah. So that's about it for this week. That's it for this week. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next week on Weekly News Roundup. I didn't say it with you. That was awkward. Sorry. We could do it again. No, it's okay. <laughs>